Hey everyone, Dan at Ochoco Bushcraft. Well, as you just saw, this is a little bit different start to any video that you've ever seen me do. But uh, I had some comments recently on uh, my videos, people um, compliment me, complimenting me on the weight that I've lost, and thank you guys, I appreciate that. And I thought that uh, I would share with you what I had been doing since um, some of you had uh, been asking me about it. And at the same time, I want to give a shout out to um, the online uh, place that I've been training that has helped me to lose almost 40 pounds since the beginning of this year and to get back in literally the best shape that I've been in since, um, since high school, really. So here I am, almost 55. And of course, everyone knows the world has been kind of upside down these past two years. Um, when I was a teenager, starting I think like at age 12 through about 20, um, I did karate and I was very, very much into it. I think I was 12 years old. I saw my first Chuck Norris movie, A Force of One, and I was hooked. That was it. I, there was a, a karate school here in town at that time and I, my mom and dad signed me up. And I was down there training regularly every week um, for about the next 10 years. And then the thing that happens to so many of us, life. <laughs> I got married. I had a son. Um, I got involved, involved in um, competitive powerlifting. And so karate just gradually faded farther and farther and farther from my life. Well, during this time of COVID, um, you know, I could just feel, and I'm sure you felt the same thing, a lot of stress, a lot of pressure, you know, not knowing one day from the next, what's going to happen, what's going to be closed, where I can go, where I can't go. And I started just looking for an outlet for all of that. And also a way, because I had gotten so heavy um, and it was time to put powerlifting behind me. You know, I competed again a couple of years ago, but my joints, my whole body just hurt and I knew it was time to change. So I started looking, hey, what thing made me feel so good when I was young? What thing got me the best shape of my life? Well, it was, it was karate. You know, I was super flexible. I was light on my feet. I was fast. I was strong. I had great cardio. All of it felt good. So, okay, this is what I need to go back to. I need to go back to the thing that I did when I was young that got me in really, really good shape and made me feel good, you know? I mean, made me smile and brought joy to my life. Well, problem. Last year during COVID, all of the karate schools in my area um, closed up. There's nothing in my town. There's nothing in the next town over. I'd, I'd be having to make these long drives to find a place to train with. It's like three-fourths of all martial arts schools in all of Central Oregon, actually even more than that, shut their doors and never reopened. Okay, so I started training on my own, but, you know, I just, I felt that I really needed some guidance to get me back into it, to get me progressing back through the levels that I once was. So I started looking online. That was my only option. And that's why I want to share this with you guys, because it's an option that any one of us can do at our homes. So I've cleared out an area, as you've seen in my garage. Um, I built some traditional Okinawan, um, they call it hojo undo, but it's, it's, you know, strength training equipment. So you can do, you know, punches with weights, the kettlebells work perfect and different things to add to it. Um, I put a little gym in my garage. I got one of these century Bob dummies to punch and kick and practice. Um, anyway. So I started looking online. I did a lot of investigating. I looked at several sites. I, I didn't care for um, how they were laid out. It just didn't seem like what I wanted to do. And I tried one for a little while. It just wasn't there. So then I came across the Worldwide Karate Association. And in the description, I'm going to give you their contact info so you can go on and check them out. Uh, Sensei John Bryan um, put together this training curriculum and it is very, very good. This is what I have been doing. 
So it's like 20 bucks a month and I can partake of online live classes um, through streaming, but I can also go into the archives and there are Coach's Corner. So Coach's Corner will be a long breakdown on one single technique, like maybe how to properly do you know, a middle block or properly do a punch. So there'll be Coach's Corner, they'll break down these individual techniques. Then there's um, all kinds of uh, classes that are recorded so that you can participate in pre-recorded classes. There is a 30-day fitness challenge, which involves all kinds of um, push-ups and abdominal exercises and things to get you back into great shape. So every day you can work out with uh, Sensei John and, and do that 30-day fitness challenge. Um, and then the heart of it is you get a curriculum. And so as you work through this curriculum and you progress and you get to the point where you're ready, so you'll, you'll get a, like a curriculum for yellow belt. That's where it starts. And then when you are ready, you'll make a video of yourself and you'll send that video to Sensei John and he will personally, uh, review your video and help you and say, okay, you know, you did everything well, or perhaps you need to work on this and work on this. But then if you um, pass your test, you get a certificate, which you can print out and put in a frame. They're really nice certificates. And then you get your next set of curriculum to start working towards your next belt level. And at any time whatsoever, and I've been doing this, you can ask questions. I've, I've paused um, in my training to uh, type in some questions and said, hey, you know, what about this technique? What about this stance or whatnot? If you are having trouble, you know, is it this way or is it this way? I'm not real sure. You can make a little video and send the video question in. And the answers have always come back uh, a quick. And, you know, it's been very personable. It's been very enjoyable. And I can tell you, having done martial arts, you know, done traditional karate do, Okinawan karate do, for almost 10 years, I know what real exams are like, and I know what real training is like. And so I can assure you, this isn't something that is soft peddled, so to speak. What I mean by that is, hey, as long as people are giving me their money, I'm just gonna hand out belts, or I'm gonna hand out certificates. I know there's places out there doing that. Uh-uh. <laughs> no, the tests are real. You, If you wanna do this, you're gonna have to work. I'm in the garage here, um, two and a half, three hours a day, six days a week, training and working my tail off. As I said, I've lost almost 40 pounds to get back in top shape and to, even though I had um, in 1984 worked through the belts and, and got to the black belt level, I want to do it once again, okay? That's something that I did was when I was you know, 18 years old. I'm almost 55. Yes, I, I earned that belt and that belt can never be taken away with me, but I want to earn it again. I want to be able to say, you know what? At 55 years old, I did the same thing that I did when I was 18 and I'm in better shape. That's my goal. That's what I'm working towards. So I'm giving this big shout out to the Worldwide Karate Association and Sensei John Bryan. Um, you know me. I'm not gonna endorse something if I don't like it. And as I said, I started one of these online courses. I paid some money out and I didn't like it. I did, I, it was not for me. I didn't think that the workouts were legitimate. So I canceled and then started looking some more and then I found the WWKA and I love what I'm doing. I love the workouts. And like I said, um, belts uh, aren't handed out. The work is real. The training is real. The tests are real. But you know, from just the, uh, the times that I've communicated back and forth and doing my own test videos and then receiving back the comments on my video, I really believe that uh, Sensei John, Sensei, by the way, if you don't know, is Japanese for teacher. It's very traditional in um, karate to call your teacher Sensei. But I, I truly believe that he cares about each person that's doing this, that um, he's not doing it 
hey, just for the money or just to hand out belts or just for notoriety or any of that. I truly believe from my experience that he wants to make karate available to people who, especially during this time, have no other way to do it. I mean, if I had never done karate before and had no experience, there's no schools in my hometown. If I drive to the next town, there's no karate schools there. I'm out of luck. But here's a guy who's put together this curriculum. So people who, who maybe you just don't want to go to the school, there is one in the area, but COVID outbreaks, you know, you're a high risk. You got family, loved ones that are high risk. You can train at home. You can get in great physical condition. You can learn um, a traditional art and self-defense and um, a lot of really good values and habits. You know, uh, you have this time every day. You get up, you go train, and the health benefits, well, phenomenal. So, yeah, I'm kind of rambling on a little bit, but um, I'm enjoying it, and I'm loving it, and I'm feeling so much better as the weight has come off. And uh, my wind has come back, my flexibility has come back. I can actually drop down into the full splits once again for the first time in so many years. And uh, I wanna share that with you guys because if you're out there during this time and you know what, you, you're having the same issues. You're stuck at home, you're putting on weight or have put on weight, you're, you're feeling the stress of it all. This is an awesome, awesome outlet. So in the description will be the contact info for Worldwide Karate Association. And there's some videos that you can watch and a ton of information there. And uh, like I said, if you're looking um, for something like this, it, I'm giving it, you know, two thumbs up. My highest uh, recommendation for Mochiko Bushcraft. Guys, take care. Fire season's almost over. Um, we're going to get out and we're going to do some fire making videos real soon. Take care.